So hey guys, I did it again. I put the whelping room actually back where it started. <laughs> um, there's a TV I am able to watch uh, YouTube on and uh, watch my own videos. Here's my endoscope that I do artificial insemination. Uh, that has a camera. Uh, I don't always use that, but I just recently did. This pool cue case has my Mavic rod in it. This just has um, three-way valves, syringes, my Omax microscope, my semen analysis microscope. I draw blood there. Gloves, pregnancy tests, progesterone tests. That TV right there is hooked up to the ultrasound machine so that my clients are able to see on a bigger screen when I ultrasound their girl. Uh, the puppies box does not have the four back panels as puppies is supposed to be replacing them. Uh, over the last seven years, we've always built uh, our whelping boxes out of plywood and a proper door and I can do stenciling on it and I likely will be doing that again very soon as, you know, just I need a box that is solid and secure for mastiffs. And that's it. Here's the exam table, my stethoscope, my uh, fetal Doppler, otoscope. Oh, just keeping track of uh, progesterone levels and numbers. And then after the pups are born and I examine them, I'm able to write weights and maybe worming dates down. Here is a cool Dollar Tree erasable little mat and uh, pretty cool. You can buy them for a buck, and I buy them, and then I erase them and reuse them sometimes, but uh, I always have extras. Small refrigerator for Hoke products. My Wanfo progesterone machine, needles, centrifuge tubes, mini centrifuge, uh, extra needles. That does light up in there, but I'm not going to do that right now. I have my mother-in-law and father-in-law's rocking chair to rock your puppy, my positioning pad, uh, video equipment, <laughs> my incubator, ALS 1803 incubator, extra uh, restock with needles and all that. What else is in here? The printer. Again, I wanted you to see it, how it's actually happening. Uh, behind those uh, four panels of the puppies box is extra needles, syringes, and AI rods, which I do have AI rods in here as well. Um, this is all going to be broken down again today, re-disinfected. I've got to get through all my puppy toys. That there is the Respironics oxygen concentrator. Every breeder should have one of them. I'm not going to get into what every breeder should have today, but um, extra needles and syringes. Uh, muzzle, because sometimes I do draw blood on dogs that are not my own and uh, have gone to hotel rooms and met people for breeding, you know, to breed their dogs. But I do not allow any dogs here on my property. We have never had parvo or lepto, and we don't want it. So that's it. Just wanted to show you guys in real time, even though I'm not quite done. wanted to show you how we really do. This is the whelping room. And that red curtain is coming down very, very soon because it's a little too much when mostly it's creams and browns and all that stuff. Well, all right, guys, that's it. Have a great day.